Hello and welcome to this Hurricane Milton update. Uh, I have to do this from my phone because I'm still out because the storm is moving way faster uh, than I expected. Uh, it's about to make landfall in the next hour or so, which is well ahead of schedule. Uh, models really underestimated the pull that the uh, upper air currents would uh, do, but it lo lo looks like the eye wall, the northern eye wall is going to be hitting Tampa. The eye is going to actually be going over sarasota right now that's what it looks like right now uh there have been a lot of tornadoes spawned by the storm some of them very large tornadoes as well um let's go look at uh the latest advisory on helene i'm sorry not helene uh our hurricane melton see president biden made the same mistake because it's just it's just so soon after helene so milton is approaching the west central coast of west central florida life-threatening storm surge damaging winds and flooding are occurring uh its location is 60 miles west southwest of sarasota florida 170 miles southwest of orlando florida maximum sustained winds are down to 120 miles an hour it's really picking up speed moving northeast at now 17 miles an hour minimum central pressure 948 millibars 28 inches so it is weakening but it's also growing in size if you look at the extent of the winds here Hurricane force winds extend outward up to 35 miles to the center, and tropical storm force winds extend outward up to 255 miles from the center. Um, let's look at some of the observations that we have in the area right now. Um, of course, I've had to do that again. I'm on my phone, so you're going to have to uh, just bear with me here. This phone is being very slow, so we're going to have to just bear with me. I closed some tabs, and maybe that'll make it go a little faster. Um, let's see if we can do that, because I just want to show you some of the observations going on, and then we're going to look at the power outage situation here. Uh, looks like we have a 61 mile an hour wind gust right now over here at this airport right here. Uh, the, red, the wind gusts are in red here, 64 mile an hour wind gust over here at uh, Sarasota, so uh, they're getting hit pretty hard. I'm sure the power is starting to go out pretty quickly over here um, by these winds. Um, and we've had some pretty strong winds on the East Coast, too. See tornado warnings. Um, if we go to poweroutage.us, um, which we'll do next. Let's try this. We'll show you Florida here now, up to 268,000 customers without power. Uh, and you can see the hardest hit area is actually on the east coast, believe it or not, uh, some of these counties. One of this county, Indian River, almost completely blacked out. That might have been due to a tornado. Um, and then we have, uh, again, I'm trying my best here, um, so it's hard for me to use the phone and do this, but I, I just want people to know that this thing is moving a lot faster, and that means people are going to get caught by surprise. Uh, by this, which is not a good thing. They thought it. Was, they, we thought the worst wasn't going to hit until after 10 o'clock tonight, and it's actually going to be hitting around, around between like well, 7 o'clock and 9 o'clock now. Uh, it's going to be making a landfall. Uh, actually, probably making a landfall within the next hour or so. At this point, the rate it's moving, it's moving very, very fast. Uh, let's just look at the. Uh, I just want to put a Milton tornadoes. We're going to just do a search on Milton tornadoes, just to show you what's been going on here. Uh, social media. Uh, let's try this. Um, maybe we just don't try Twitter. Let's just do this. Milton tornadoes. Let's just do this here and uh, we get some information here. Uh, if we can get some images of the tornadoes uh, that have been spawned by Milton, because uh, there are a couple of them here. Uh, tornadoes. Let's see if these are. Uh, yeah, this is one of them right here. Look at that wedge tornado. Uh, so there's some big tornadoes that were spawned. Very unusual to see. But anyway, I will have more later at our usual weather update time, 9:30 ish. Um, but uh, this storm is moving much much faster than anticipated. So the worst is going to be hitting Tampa in the next couple of hours or so. Um, so. Um, Hopefully everybody is out of there and or, and or hunkered down and praying for Florida.